This is a video to demonstrate how Duplicate Views works. Duplicate Views is a tool set found under Project Builder. Uh, the purpose of Duplicate Views is to allow you to quickly batch create views uh, of annotation views assigned with view templates. Let's take a look first how you would manually set up annotation views without the tool. You would take a floor level views and for each view you would then duplicate it, assign it a name. You would need to manually change the name. Let's say we're creating floor plan, which is the construction plan view. You then need to assign a view template so that you can control the visibility of it. So we go to the view template of that view and select floor plans which is under the A0400 uh, section. Apply OK. As you hit Apply, it will put it under the section of A0400. You then need to repeat the process for um, floor 2 to 12, as well as the same process needs to be repeated for each one of the different annotation views, such as furniture plan, power plan, equipment plan, so on and so forth. Now let's take a look at how we would do it using the tools. So using the duplicate views, on the first panel here, I can select floor plans. I can check the, the floors that I wanted to create. Let's say I'm only going to do the first two floors here. I wanted to create a series of floor plans, furniture plan, finish plan, power plan, and equipment plan. I need to assign different view templates for each one. So for floor plans, I will use the A400. For the furniture plan, I will use A0800. And finish plans will be 700s. And power plan will be 806. And equipment will be... All right, maybe I'll do three floors here. So for level one, two, and three, for each floors, I will create one, two, three, four, five annotation views, each one assigned to different view templates. I make sure I make a check mark so those are the selected. Whatever is not selected will not be created. And I just wanted to see what uh, it will look like once the views are created in terms of view name. So I will click the preview names and here it tells me there's 15 views to be created. And if I wanted to use duplicate with details, I would just simply toggle the radio button here. And in case my naming convention is different, uh, here we have the level first, then the category name. We can also reverse that and do category then level. So I think that's a little more confusing. Okay, so that looks good. Now, if in case I didn't delete that uh, floor plan that we created earlier, it would um, warn me here and says that that view already exists and you can skip it. So let's go ahead and hit preview and um, duplicate views. It will warn me again. Are you sure you want to create these 15 views? I'm going to say yes. And it says all views have been successfully created. Well, let's take a look and where the views are. So we know we created floor plans, power plans, finish plans, and furniture plan. Let's expand it here. We got three, first floor, second floor, third floor. Let's take a look at the first floor. It goes and shows me the template, view templates assigned, second floor, and third floor. Same thing with the power plan and finish plan and furniture plan and equipment plan. So as you can see, you can very quickly generate all these annotation views with just one simple click. Thank you.